Hello everybody, special day today we're visiting Coda Systems. My host is Mr Harvey Davis and we're going to be looking at the world of test probes and spring-loaded connectors. So Harvey, thank you for hosting us. Let's see what Coda Systems is all about. You're very welcome. So thanks Harvey for hosting us today. Now we're familiar with Coda Systems. We've, you've been on our websites for a number of years. Um, but I'd like to find out a little bit more about the company. So, could we start by asking the history of the company? How did it all start? Well, uh, my dad started the company in 1980. Um, he's now sadly long, no longer with us. Um, so now myself and my brother Howard have been running the business for many, many years. And now um, my brother's son, George, is now the third generation of the family. He's our new design engineer. Oh, that's brilliant. So, so it's a truly family-run business. Absolutely. Yeah, it's a few and far between, sadly, these days. So that's, that's, that's really good. Uh, so, UK-based? Yes. And your assembly as well is based in the UK? Yes. Uh, and actually, in particular, these products behind us, our uh, docking connectors, are built and assembled in Suffolk. Right. Excellent. Okay, so again, that's uh, another important point for us. Now, I notice on the wall here that we've got an array of catalogues. Um, What's behind all of those? Well, when, when my dad started the business, it was you know, obviously pre-internet, um, so everything was printed, so he, he had a, a, a printed catalogue, and we, we found them all from 1980 onwards, and we just thought it would be nice to put them up on the wall, and um, it's sort of like a, a catalogue history of the company, really, and of all our products we've ever sold. Yeah, so looking at it, wh what were the products when, you when the business started, what were the pro main products that you were selling? Well, uh, yeah, in 1980 when it started, um, we were a stockist and distributor for spring contact test probes, which are used um, in the electronics product in industry for testing PCBs, um, testing values um, and functionality. And we, we still do that range of products. We've got a very large range of those. Um, but in more recent times, we've uh, branched out into interconnection products, spring-loaded right. contacts, docking connectors. Okay, so it's evolved and developed yeah. uh, from the side of things. So, like we say, we're familiar with the company name. Could we see some of these products? Yes, uh, in fact, uh, George, our design engineer, has got some new products that we're launching very, very soon that um, he can show you. That'd be great. Let's see those. So George, Harvey has told us about some new products um, that are coming to market mm. from Coda Systems. Could you take us through some of the existing products, first of all, that Coda offer? Yeah, so uh, we offer a, a range of Swift Dock docking connectors that we've been developing for about 10 or 12 years. Okay. Uh, it started off with just the standard Swift Dock. So this has got a seven millimeter pitch um, and it connects like this. And then we found that customers were asking for different types of connectors. So they were looking for smaller connectors. So that's where the Swift Dock Mini came in. So this is a much smaller connector at three millimeters a pitch. But then other customers are wanting more power transfer. So okay. then we had to develop a Swift Dock Ultra, which allows for up to 12 amps of connection. Uh, and then they also wanted some data transfer as well. So we've developed both data and data power which can either just transfer data or transfer data and power, like this one here. Uh, for all of these products, or, or some of these products, we offer a few extras. So you can buy a magnetic connector, which connects like this, uh, or just a regular cover, which connects like this. Okay. So more recently, we've been developing a much smaller connector, even so than the Mini, which is called the Micro. Micro. Um, this has only got a 2.2 millimeter pitch, so it's very, very small. Okay, it's tiny. Yeah, really small. And then it, we, we expect it to go in sort of wearables and medical devices. So this is just a quick mock-up of the type of device that we think it will go in. And if you okay. open it up here, you can see that it fits in a sort of clamshell system. Right. So this, okay. is the, this is the side that will be put inside the device. And this can be completely waterproof with an O-ring. And then we've also got this side, which would be in the dock, which wouldn't be waterproof. Right. Now, one of the things I noticed there, you're saying that a lot of these things have come about from 
clients actually asking for variations? Yes, yeah, a lot of our development work has come from that, particularly at the, the shows that we go to. You know, people come up and ask for this or that, they'll ask for more power, smaller size. So actually the micro came from last year's show. A lot of people are coming up saying we're developing smart watches or wearable torches and things like that. And they were like, we haven't got the space for even the, mic the mini. So we had to, to sort of go to the design stage and develop something even smaller. Right. So that's where that came from. So yeah, it's, it's a, a lot of it is customer driven. But we also do do a bit of um, fiddling about, you know, trying to decide what the market needs just from our point of view. So we have done a little bit of development that way. Yeah, I totally understand. But it really showcases that Coda Systems actually can meet the needs. So somebody comes to you with an obscure request, mm. the chances are you can probably find a solution. Yeah, yeah, we're all ears. And uh, even if sometimes we can't do a solution ourselves, we can sort products that maybe we can buy in for them and that kind of thing. So uh, yeah, we, we're, we're quite customer driven in that way. That's excellent. Listen, thank you ever so much, George. I really appreciate no it. No worries, thank you. So thank you, Harvey. It's been a really good day. I've taken a lot of uh, knowledge away from this. Now, for viewers that are watching the video, where can they find out more? Well, uh, we've got a fully e-commerce website. We have had for many years. Um, and one of the really strong points of our website is particularly for our um, interconnection products, uh, we've got downloadable CAD files, which you know we've found is really useful for design engineers, you know, because they can download the CAD files, drop them into their designs and see what works. Um, and also, um, we don't have a minimum order quantity. So if a designer wanted to order just perhaps one or two of our products, um, they can do that and we'll send them to them and they can do their prototyping and testing in that way. And um, we also ship globally direct from our headquarters here. Right. So any, anywhere in the world. No, that's fantastic. That's really good. Thank you very much for an excellent day. Really enjoyed it. Really great insight into what you do here um, and what you're doing going forward with the product development as well. So if you've enjoyed watching this and you'd like to find out more, check out the web address at the bottom of the screen. You can find out even more of what the company does. Also as well, if you've got questions or things you'd like to find out, why not contact Harvey and George and the team here and I'm sure they'll be happy to answer them. Thanks very much for watching and we look forward to seeing you on the next video.